Okay, this is the phone. I'm coming to replace the LCD. The first thing you have to do, you have to put a date machine, at least for 10 to 15 if you have data at home. If you have this machine, you can still open it because this one is a robot, it's not a glass. No need to scare. Just find pencil, something very sharp. Make sure you put it here on the cover side. Okay, try to ace it up a bit like this. Okay. No need to scare. Okay, it's a robot. Okay. After you open it a bit like you can still use your hand also hold it like this. Just pull it. Don't scare, nothing will break. Just open it. Okay, just force to open it. This, remove the back cover. Okay. There's so many screws here. You need to take out all the screw back of this one because you need to take out the frame. So make sure you remove all the screw. Okay. Don't leave any screw. Take out all the screw up and down everywhere. Okay. Make sure you remove all the screw. Down here, everywhere. Take out the screw. So many, many screws. Make sure you take out all the screw. Don't leave any screw. Okay. Make sure you take out all the screw back of the phone, okay? After I take out all the screw back of the phone, then you remove the seam tray from the hair, the top here. Put it one side. Okay, if you have nails, you can use your nails, just open the cover right hand. If you don't have nails, just use the pencil, just open it right hand. Be careful for the fingerprint cable, okay? Just open it and hold, make sure you hold the cover when you open it. Because the fingerprint cable is there, okay? Hold the cover like this. Okay, just slide it a bit like this and take out this cover on top. Okay, this is the fingerprint cable. Okay, then put this on one side. This is the battery. Okay, this is the LCD cable. This is the LCD cable. Okay, leave this one. Okay, now you need to take out this uh, green plastic here to pull the battery. Okay, there's another plastic here also. This one. Just remove it, the white one. Okay, then hold the green one and pull the plastic. Pull it to remove the battery. It's hard, but just try to pull it. Nothing happens. Do it slowly. Take out the battery. Okay, put it one side. Okay, now I need to remove this plastic again here. Yeah. Just remove it a bit so you can have access to take out the LCD cable. Remove the LCD cable. Okay. And put that it match at least for 10 to 15 so you can remove the LCD. If you have it machine at home, just force to open it because you don't need this LCD anymore, so there's nothing for you to scare about. Okay, okay. After I hit it for 10 to 15 minutes, it make it more easy for you to open if you have the heater. If you have the heater, just force to open it, okay? You don't need to scare because this LCD you don't you don't need it anymore. Just open it, try to remove the LCD, okay? Check out the this one. Now you need to take out all the half half LCD blue brick one. Make sure you remove all these half half ones. Make sure you clean it very nice. Okay, clean, clean it very nice right now. Remove all the glue. Remove everything right now so the new glue can rest properly. Be careful. Okay. After you clean the glue right now, okay, before you put the new glue and fix the LCD, make sure you test the LCD first and make sure the LCD is okay because sometimes even the new LCD is not working. So please make sure you test this right before you put the glue and fix the LCD, okay? Now you need to put the glue right on the phone. Make sure you put it very nice like this. Don't put it on top of the front camera, okay? Just put it close to it like this. Don't put it on top of the sensor, okay? Just put it close to the sensor like this, okay? So I don't normal function, okay? Okay, make sure you put the glue right on very nice. Just put it right on very nice, okay? After you put the glue right on the phone, okay, now you need to fix the new LCD. Make sure you take out this plastic here in front of the camera here so the camera become more clear, okay? Then you remove the warranty sticker so that the LCD can rest properly from this side. Remove the warranty sticker. Okay. Then you take out this plastic down here. Be very be careful when you do it so you don't spoil the connector. Do it slowly. Okay. Here's the connector up and this let's take out this one. Okay. Now you need to pass the LCD cable from this side. Okay. Just pass the cable like this. Very nice. Okay. And put the LCD very straight. Don't bend it. Okay, make sure it's very straight, like this. Okay. Then you fix the LCD connector. Make sure you have the right position before you press it in. Don't force the press it in if you have the right position so you don't spoil the connector on the motherboard, okay? Okay. Then you make way for the battery to rest, like this. Okay, then remove this plastic back and close it. 
Okay, move on this one also. Okay, then put back the battery. Make sure the battery is very straight. Fix the battery connector first before you put the battery down so you don't lose the position of the battery. Okay, open this plastic properly. And this one I have also. Make sure the battery rests properly. Closes all this plastic. Very nice. Okay. Then you fix the fingerprint cable first before you put the cover. Fix the fingerprint cable first. Very nice. Very nice like this. Okay. Then you put back this cover. Make sure you fix all the clips. Very nice. Okay. Put back this back cover on top. Close this right one. Very nice. Make sure you close properly. Replace all the screw you take out back. So many, many screw. To leave any screw behind, make sure you place all the screw you take out back, okay? Make sure you replace all the screw, okay? After you place all the screw right around the phone, okay, now you put the glue right around the phone. Make sure you put it right around, very nice. Don't put on top of the screw, okay? Make sure you put it right around, very nice. After you put the glue right around the phone, okay, now you put the cover very straight, don't bend it. Make sure you put it very straight like this. Make sure it rests properly inside very nice. Okay, if you have a rubber light, you can use it for 30 minutes so the glue will come dry before you take it out so the glue will dry very nice. If you have a rubber light, you can still use a solid tape, just put it there like this, the three side. Make sure you tape it properly so the screen and back of rest properly. Okay, and put the top here also. Okay, don't forget to back the symmetry. Okay, and on the phone to try the LCD and see if it's okay. As you can see, the logo already showed the LCD is okay. That means okay. Hello, guys. If you like my video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.